Good morning, Toastmasters. Good morning. And guests. Good morning. Good morning. Welcome. Glad you're all here. And get up early in the morning and uh, get feedback. So, what I am talking about today is I want to start with a question. What are some of the most enjoyable times you've had with your friends, family, uh, co workers, what have you? Just think about that for a minute. What are some of the most enjoyable times? Well, for me, some of the most enjoyable times are tailgating. <laughs> Any kind of event, whether it's basketball, football, hockey, I mean, ice skating, I mean, you name it. <laughs> <laughs> but that is some of the most enjoyable times for me, and, and I'm here to tell you how, the, for me personally, the fun way to tailgate. And here's, here's how you do it. There's really only five steps. One of the steps is uh, the preparation which I think is very, very key to a tailgate because you have to be prepared for how many people you have, what you're trying to bring, you know, whatever, you're, whatever you're trying to accomplish for the tailgate, you have to kind of bring it beforehand because once you get there, you can't get out of the parking lots unless you have friends coming and what have you. So preparation is very, 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 very key. I think it's the most important part. The other part is a setup. The other part is just uh, enjoying each other's company. Which so that's two, and then three is enjoying each other's company. Four is the takedown. There's always with a setup. There's a takedown, which is the most painful part. <laughs> and then the fourth is the game. Whatever, whatever professional event or college event, whatever, whatever you're going to see, that's the the final step, which is the most you know that's fun. So um, with the uh, preparation, the biggest thing is write down the the num number of people that are coming. For to be prepared, you have to have the number of people here that are coming so you can get enough food, enough games, whatever the case may be. Uh, another thing to have is a tent. In the hot sun, obviously down here in Florida, that's one of the critical pieces because it gets so hot out there when you're playing the games and whatever, you want to kind of get in the shade and, and cool off a little bit. Third thing that you should also get in that is the food. Me personally, I grill. I like to bring a grill and, and make sure you bring the grill utensils you can do subs and things of that nature, but you know, it's, it's fun grilling. And you just get some hamburgers, sausage, and hot dogs. Pretty simple, it's quick and easy. You like hot dogs, don't you? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, I saw you smiling. So just get what your food is, and of course, don't forget the food, the uh, chips and dip. You know, I always, what I always like to do is kind of give someone to get chips and dip, get the, the um, condiments. To get different different things to kind of bring, I'll bring all the toys, all the fun things. And then the fourth the fourth thing you'd really want to make sure you get is dessert. I mean, who, who doesn't like dessert? Come on, everyone loves cookies and whatever cakes. Yeah, I'm a coconut cream pie guy, so I'm not sure if I eat it. But make sure you get all that, you know, all that stuff prepared first. Then you just go out there and you set it up. I also bring games. My one of my favorite is cornhole. You know what cornhole is. Okay, well, cornhole is a game. You throw bean bags through a little hole and, and you throw them on each side. And there's ladder ball. That's another game. That ladder ball is just two little balls on the end with a string, and you got to throw it on three different levels. So I'm not sure if you're familiar with that, but that's a fun game to play at the tailgating experience. Uh, we also have footballs, baseball, whatever, whatever you want to bring, you can you can bring it and kind of just go out there and have a good time. Uh, and then, of course, the most one of the most important is the beverages. We get people to bring pop, beer. We be, usually keep it to pop and beer. We don't want to have hard alcohol at a tailgate because then people get out of control and stupid. So <laughs> that's not fun going to a game with out of control stupid people. So, <laughs> so that's pretty much the, the whole you know, preparation set up and then in the enjoyment part. Uh, the worst part is the, the taking down of the, the tent, the getting all the, the pieces together, the food, the cleanup. You know, it's it's you know after having a, a few cold beverages, you you kind of just want to get into the game and you want to enjoy. It. You just want to leave it there sometimes, but it's uh, unfortunately nature of the beast. The setup you have to take down. So take down, and then the final the final thing is just going to the game. It's uh, me personally, as I've told you before, my goal is to go to every <clears throat> NFL stadium and actually go to a game before I die. And it's, <laughs> I'm moving up the list. And so, I mean, pretty much uh, the biggest part, again, like I said, is just the preparation. Just make sure you're prepared on a tailgate. Whatever fun games you like to play, cornhole being one of my favorites, ladder ball, what have you. 
just make sure you bring everything with you and plan accordingly. Most people just kind of piece, piece tailgating together, which you, you can't do. It's too hard because once you get there and if everyone's there, you can't. There's not stores you can go to. There's not places you can typically buy, you know, drinks, pop, what have you. So just basically <coughs> be prepared, grill, and enjoy your time. Tailgating is a fun time and it's a good way to get people together and have fun enjoy themselves. So thank you very much.